other side of the bed are the father and mother of Mrs. Bucket. This is Mrs. Bucket, and the small boy standing right there is Charlie Bucket, her only son. Here you go, Grandpa Joe, cabbage soup. Every day, nothing but cabbage soup. Cheer me up, Charlie. Tell me, what's the chocolate news? Walker's got a new bar out. <sighs> Fudge Mallow for Whipple Bakes. Mallow with flavor shifters. Flavor shifters, mine. You've been sitting next to me for how many years, and now you decide to say hi? George, she didn't say hi. She said flavor shifters, mine. What do you mean, why? I don't know why. George, she didn't say hi or why. She said flavor shifters, ma, ma. Sure, I'd love a piece of pie. <laughs> Perfectly installed toothpaste caps, Charlie. You think I might work in the toothpaste factory one day? Let's hope not, Charlie. What kind of positive thinking is that? Charlie is going to work for Mr. Willy Wonka making chocolate bars. Now, Grandpa Joe, don't go filling the boy's head with dreams of candy. Brandy, I love one. She <laughs> said candy. What? Candy! No need to yell. I'm saying right here. <laughs> Anyway, Charlie comes from a long line of distinguished candy men. And women. But Wonka hasn't hired anyone since Wonka worked spy stole his candy balloon recipe. Wonka was so angry, he gathered all his workers saying, I'm sorry, we must all go home. Then he locked the gates of the factory forever. But Mr. Wonka still makes candy. I can smell them on my way to school. Yes, but no one goes in and no one comes out. Shadow workers. Maybe the undead. Who knows? Now, Grandpa Joe, you're going to give Charlie nightmares again. Charlie wants to play gin? I'm in. <laughs> Charlie, why don't you run out and see if anyone's done with the day's paper? Okay, Mom. Here you are, George. Cabbage soup. I thought we were playing gin. <laughs>
to be open to a lucky few. You mean they're actually going to let people inside the factory? Read what it says. Mr. Willy Wonka has decided to allow five children into his factory. The five children will receive a tour of the factory and win a lifetime supply of chocolate. Tour the factory? A lifetime supply of chocolate? Read on! Five golden tickets have been hidden among five million ordinary candy bars. The finders of these tickets will win the tour and the chocolate. That's a million to one shot. What you guys talking about? Wanda's having a contest. Why wouldn't you want a screen test? A contest! Who is? Wonka! What about him? He's having a contest! Oh, right, geez, I'm not deaf, you know. <laughs> Tickets could be anywhere. How exciting. I wonder if any of them have been found yet. The paper's a day old. Charlie, can you imagine winning? Tour of the factory? Meeting Mr. Wonka? Seeing for yourself all those undead zombie workers? <laughs> Eating a lifetime supply of chocolate. Eating a lifetime supply of chocolate. Ah. <laughs> One o'clock already? Charlie, you better get going. You don't want to be late for school. But Charlie, remember, we may be starving, we may be poor, but the Bucket family always is positive. Right in purple ink. Now we will never forget it. Okay, Grandpa Joe. See you later. Bye, Bye Charlie. So Mrs. Bucket went back to the toothpaste factory, but little Charlie Bucket went on his way to school. But on his way, he heard some exciting news. Hey Charlie, did you hear about the news? Someone found a horse school and ticket! Already led! Today, look!
So call us at 1-800, we're not. Major credit cards accepted. But ticket, Mr. Salt. Oh yes, of course. So we must have bought hundreds of thousands of longa bars and had my factory workers stop shelling nuts and start shelling wrappers. And how many wrappers look like that the job? None, you e-brain. Veruca doesn't do manual labor. We have people for that. And my father will have you fired for mispronouncing my name, won't you, Daddy? Whatever you want, my little sugar plum. So after days of shelling wrappers, one of my factory workers found a golden ticket. I rewarded her by letting her take the lucky piece of chocolate home to her 17 kids. I did not have the heart not to, you know what I mean? How generous. Daddy, now she's being sarcastic. I want to fire. You hear me? Fire, fire, fire! This is Fiona Chow, where the sweet has rapidly turned sour. And don't forget the nuts! Yes, it seems you can't have the chocolate without the nuts. <laughs> Gee, after just one day, there are only three gold tickets left. The Buffalo winners are quits. You would think one deserving kid would win. Mom, why aren't you at work? Didn't they close the factory early? I'm afraid so, Charlie. In fact, they've closed it forever. I don't know if I'm going to tell your grandparents. Things were bad when I had the job, but now... Don't worry, Mom. Like Grandpa Joe said, think positive. <laughs>
remember is whatever happens, you still have the bar of candy. Yes, I know. For goodness sake, open it! Open it, Aaron. You're making me jumpy. Anything. It's all on my computer for free. Some kids 
genius. Well, thanks. I better get to school. You think I could have just one more? I'll pay for it. Why not? I'd give you another one, but the boss is pretty strict about inventory. What will be, Charlie, my boy? Well, I think I'll share this one with my family. Grandma Jo likes to walk and hide in her surprise, but Grandma Josephina likes to not have Then you should get the Whipple Scrumptious Not Horrific Totally Twisted Combo Arm. Just out. Here you go. I know you're gonna share it and all, but might as well take a little taste, you know, to make sure it's not bad or anything. <laughs>
such things. There certainly are, my dear, and a wing jiggle would just love to sink sharp fish's fangs into you. A gossip my talk must never do touch by human hands. Too late. <laughs> Great, he's going to give us call to millions of people. It's so good. I think I've had too much chocolate. Huh?
money. Fantastic invention. It'll revolutionize the candy industry. There's no limit to what candy makers would pay to get their hands on this top secret little gem. Now come, take a look at my latest invention. Whoa. 
one piece, and at the same time, sort the good nuts from the bad nuts. They're so adorable. Here's Squirrely Squirrely. Break up! Whatever you do, do not disturb the squirrels. They were in training. See here, Wonka. I want a squirrel. <laughs> I want a squirrel and an Oompa. I want a squirrel and an Oompa and a pink candy book. And while we're at it, I want a feast. I want to be beast. Cream and donuts and fruit cake with no nuts. So good you could go nuts. Give them to me. Now, I want a party with my balls of ice I want a ton of ice cream. And if I don't get the things I'm after, I'm gonna
consolation prize, a lifetime supply of chocolate. That's the consolation prize? What's the real prize? Charlie, do you love my factory? It's the most wonderful place in the whole world. I'm very pleased to hear you say that, Charlie. Because from this moment on, it's yours. What do you mean? I'm giving you my factory, Charlie. I need an heir, and that person is you. You want me to run this entire factory? But my mom and Grandpa Joe and the entire family can live here. I'd love to. I'd positively love to. Take a look and you'll see 
salvation. So go there to be free if you truly wish to. Be